Welcome to one of Crossworld's command centers. I'm Ames Lermith, I use she, her pronouns, and I'm the showrunner of Flat Earth Theater's Seven Rooms, The Mask of the Red Death. Let me show you around a little bit, the backstage of Prospero's virtual manor. I'm working with our diligent stage management team from the study of my own house. Live virtual theater comes with challenges all its own, and we're tackling them in real time. And it all starts right here in the Zoom window where we're streaming the show. Now, it may look like Prospero is here in the Zoom with us, but she's not. Each of the stage management team is running a program called OBS to run our Zoom rooms. And we're using a plugin called NDI to hook up OBS into the Zoom. You got all that? Because this is where it gets complicated. Prospero's live feed is being run through our ASM Mickey's computer in New York. And our fearless stage manager, Deidre, is running all the live sounds through a program called QLab and also coordinating with the whole team through our personal room over here in the Discord. Got all that? Good, because now we're going into breakout rooms. The really cool thing about Seven Rooms, The Mask of the Red Death, is that the audience can choose their path through the manor. And what's interesting about that? Well, you're going to have a wholly different experience depending on the route that you take. In our first brainstorming meeting with the whole playwright-director teams, we let them loose in a Google Doc where they could type in whatever was inspiring them about the show. And something magical happened in there. Not only were they inspired by the project, but they were inspired by each other, referencing each other in the doc, building off what each other was saying, and the individual plays are just like that. You can find Easter eggs from one room to another, and you'll notice different things depending on the route that you take. So we have our ASMs Liv and Paige, and also me, stewarding these breakout rooms so that you may enjoy the masquerade in whatever manner you choose. Until that infernal clock chimes midnight, but I'm not here to spoil a Poe story for you. We hope to see you at the masquerade! <laughs>